local coverage you can count on continues with Glenn Marini's Sports Report. Sports coverage you can count on. The Archers aiming high, and they were without a doubt on target. Antwerp earning the Ohio Division IV softball state title. They did that by beating Mechanicsburg 5-0 on Sunday morning. And with that, we're proud to honor the Archers softball squad as your Optimum Performance Sports Team of the Week. Hi, this is Matt Roth, Manager of Ops. I'd like to be the first to congratulate this week's Team of the Week. Congratulations. We're over here in Antwerp, Ohio. They are the softball state champs in Division IV in Ohio, joined by the head coach, Krista Ordway. So what was it like winning that state title with all these girls? Oh, man, just super exciting, This overjoyed with happiness and excitement and just such a well-deserved honor for these girls. They have worked hard all season, and they definitely earned it, for sure. Take me back to the game. Obviously, it was a 5 nothing victory, but it was closer than the score may appear. How tough was that state title game, especially coming back after a Saturday night rain delay into Sunday morning? Um, yeah, we were tied 0-0 to the fourth inning, and then um, we noticed, well, I noticed that um, she was, the pitcher was kind of getting up and down with her pitches. She was kind of getting a little wild, and... Um, so I was like, okay, this is next inning is going to be our inning. I have a feeling. And the fans were going nuts. And that just the environment there was just crazy. And, like, the girls could feel it. I could tell they were pumped and ready. And so, yeah, we just opened it up that fifth inning, and it was history after that. I want to talk about a moment before then. Obviously, getting a shot back off Carly's leg. Uh, was your heart in your, in your throat as a coach? Oh, yeah. I was like, oh, no. Um, but kind of, like, I know how tough she is. She's and she's kind of stubborn, like, you know, so I knew as soon as I walked out there, I already knew what the answer was going to be. Like, I'm not coming out of this game. I already knew she was going to tell me that. Um, but I was just hoping, like, it, she didn't have, like, something wrong seriously with her. So um, as soon as I went out there and, you know, Kirk was checking on her and um, she was like, it's fine, it's fine, I'm going to be good. And so she threw that pitch and I was like, oh, okay, she's good. So, yeah, she's so tough that I just knew that she was, there was nothing taking her out of that game ever. So. All right. Um, yeah. Go Let's ahead. check it over here to Carly because obviously you're the one with the bruise on the leg. I mean, what did it feel like when that thing came off your leg? It was very painful, but I knew that as soon as it came off my leg, I had to try and get the ball and get her out. But it was just, it was kind of very shocking to me that it happened because I've been hitting the leg before and it's very shocking that you get hit. But I wasn't expecting it like, to like happen at all. Like throughout the game, I wasn't. It never occurred to me like, oh, I'm gonna get a line drive to the leg today. Like I'm feeling it. Like <laughs> you just don't expect it. And it happens, and you just have to try and make the best of it. Uh, there was no way you're coming out of the game, though, right? No, I was not going to get taken out of that game. I was very determined that I was going to finish what I started. Uh, it was a long day between Saturday night's rain delay, Sunday morning's early game, and then the three-hour drive back to Antwerp. So what was it like the finally when you guys arrived at the school to see all those people? It was so awesome because there was just a whole bunch of people there, and they were so welcoming. They were so thrilled to know that we won that game and that's the first time for softball ever for the school that has won the state championship so everyone was really hyped and pumped about it because they knew like we made history and it was I just thought it was really cool that everyone was there they always had signs and stuff and they were just really excited and pumped that we won and they knew it they knew all right congrats to the archers your team of the week and we'll see if the Antwerp baseball team can bring home a state title, just like the ladies did this coming weekend. You can read more about that on the Wayne.com sports page. That does it for sports. I'm Glenn Marini, and we're back in two.